As we previously reported, the shoe giants Adidas, Nike, and Under Armour did not offer a shoe deal to NBA prospect Lonzo Ball. Lonzo Ball's father, LeVar, was undeterred as he claimed that he would get a shoe for his son on the market, and he succeeded in releasing the Zo 2 Primes to the tune of $495. And there's actually another a pair of sneakers that were released called the Wet Sneaker, which was, includes an autographed signature of Lon from Lonzo on the sneaker itself. Um, a lot of people balked at the price of the shoe, thinking it was too steep. And in response, LeVar Ball tweeted, and I quote, if you can't afford the Zo 2s, you're not a big baller. So Mike LeVar, we're talking about him again. He's the gift that keeps on giving for us. And do you think that this shoe will be a flop? Has LeVar again stuck his foot in his mouth? Or could this actually be successful? I think a lot of it depends on the success of what happens with Lonzo Ball once he comes into the league, right? If he comes in and he's a flop, he's not he's putting up 11 points a game, or if he gets injured, or if he's not doing what people expect of him, then the shoe's probably not going to wind up taking off the way that people would hope. However, if he comes into the NBA and he's one of the you know gets rookie of the year, he's making an All Star appearances, and he's doing what we expect of him, then certainly that's going to help the the marketing for this shoe. It's it's so expensive though and I just don't like the way that they've detached themselves or isolated themselves from a lot of the people from lower to middle class people that really cannot afford the shoe. I understand the comparisons that people have made with Michael Jordan over the course of the last 25 years, 30 years since he's had his own shoe, not his own shoe company, but his own shoe brand. And yes, Michael Jordan does charge, so any, not Michael Jordan himself, but yeah. the Jordan <laughs> brand does charge anywhere from 200 to sometimes 400 $450 for Michael Jordan sneakers. The difference is Michael Jordan Jordan has six NBA championships and a Hall of Fame yeah. <laughs> career to, to, to show for it. Yeah, I mean, I think that's part of the reason why people are balking at the price. I mean, it is an expensive sneaker, but it's for someone who's unproven. The, the shoe costs two to three times more than a LeBron sneaker or a Jordan sneaker. And as you mentioned, these are champions. They are in conversation of being the greatest of all time and I think that even if Lonzo does prove himself on the court once he gets to the NBA I think once again his father is going to be a hindrance to him especially because we don't I don't foresee LeVar Ball toning down his behavior at all I think that's his personality whether it's called narcissism or having illusions of grandeur or whatever it is I think that's so ingrained in him that he's not going to stop and he's limiting his son.